guys, welcome to my newest video for today. Today's video is going to be somewhat of a different kind of video because I thought I would um, do a stationery haul because I've been um, like stationery shopping with going back to uni next month and I thought, you know what, rather than just include it all in a random haul, I thought I would um, break them into individual hauls because there's a couple of other um, just because I've got so much stuff like this time round and yeah so I thought it would make a different video um, if you're wondering about the background um, I'm still filming in my room but I'm filming um, facing my shelves because um, they're a bit of a mess at the moment um, basically I'm rearranging everything and stuff is everywhere and it looks really bad <laughs> the way it is at the moment but once I get it all sorted um, it should hopefully look okay so but um anyway I'll just get straight into it um most of my stuff came from Big W but I do have a few things that came from Officeworks because I went there today but um I'll start with the Big W stuff because I got that first and the first one is I have a couple of sharpies like highlighters um I actually didn't get this uh this my parents got me these um but I think they got this from Coles because I needed highlighters and even though I could have easily gotten like a four pack or something, a six pack um, but apparently these um, are smear resistant so if I'm highlighting notes and that I shouldn't smudge them so which is always good but um, yeah that's just um, highlighters so yeah and I got my notebooks that I'm going to be using for this semester. Or tri well, we call them trimesters at the uni that I'm at, um, but it's really basically a, like the equivalent of a semester. Um, I think it's just a bit shorter, like because they how they arrange the uni timetable and that. Um, I'm not a hundred percent familiar with the technical, like all the technical details, but. Yeah, when I, if I say trimester, I, like I mean, it's basically semester because I'm sort of like um, jump between the two. But um, the notebooks that I'm using are the A4 five subject books because I've used this before and it's they're really good. Um, you basically get with the dividers, I can have two in each, like two subjects in each folder because I have four like, four classes. Uh, this trimester so um yeah and it i because first trimester last year i had these similar books and it like i didn't run out of space because there's also um like you just have a general one at the back once the yeah so oh, actually i think but I, I think that one's part, actually part of that one i thought it was a separate like notepad but um, I think one of the ones I had last year had a separate like like additional paper but um, and this one's just exactly the same so um, yeah I always like the five folder ones because um, second try I was a bit um, broke and I couldn't afford to get these ones um, at the start so basically I just like I got just cheap um, folders but I like these ones because I don't have to carry so much stuff so they're the notebooks that I got for this first half and then I got this um, stationery set that has three pencils a rubber and a sharpener in it um, basically I got caught out last year and I didn't have a pencil and I needed one for the for an exam that I was doing so I had to do multiple choice in one of my exams and then I was like, I was like, right, this year I'm being prepared and um, probably now that I'm prepared I won't need these pencils but it's just nice to just have them in case I need it for whatever reason and this is HB, um, I've never really known the difference between 2B and HB, I was told I think 2B is darker or something because I think most people prefer you to use 2B but honestly I've used HB before and I've never got caught like caught out on it so um 
I just make sure I just circle it in really dark when if I'm doing one which ways. But but yeah, that's just the pencil set I got. So I thought it was just a bit. That's a cheaper way of getting a sharpener and a rubber. So there you go. So stationary set. And then I got some blue tack because I was out of blue tack. I think I went through quite a few packs when like a couple of packs when I was actually at uni last year and um because mostly I use this like the you know posters on my wall um if I had to put like sticky notes around I think that's where quite a bit um got used and also I really just like playing with the blue tag it's a really weird habit that you sort of just get a bit and then you just sort of fiddle with it and I think that's how I end up using like a whole stick because I just um I have to have something like in my hands if I'm like just sitting at my desk like because I like um, even if it's a pen or something like that it's um, I, I'm just weird like that but yeah I haven't like a new blue tack thing I will probably have to get another lot um, at some point in this year because I say this is going to go pretty quick but um yeah that's blue tack and then I got a new packet of pens um, this is the big round stick because I had these last year and they were really good. I do have a full pen, like a pack of pens, but they were like the really cheap ones and they're still in their packet because I got them for emergency, like in case I ran out of pens or something and basically I could have used those this year, like instead of buying them, but I really like these pens because they it comes with like, you know, blues, blacks and reds and um yeah, I just thought, you know what, I'll just get another packet and then I've still got my emergency pens, so. And I ended up losing quite a few of my pens, like, throughout the year and half of them ended up really chewed up because I chew on my pens. Yeah, it's, I know it's a bad habit, but. But, um, yeah, I just got these. And, like, they're not too expensive, but I think they're just, like, pretty good quality, so. Yeah big round stick pens and I think the last one in this bag is I got whiteboard markers um, basically at my room at college we have a whiteboard outside our room and they provided you with a pen like they provide a pen for first years I'm pretty sure and um, like I've still got the pen that they did but I kept it in my room because pens tended to have a habit of going missing like people would take them off and like if they were going by the room and especially like you know if they were drunk or something and yeah pens went missing and I thought right I'm gonna get myself a packet of pens and then that way I can leave them like one on my like whiteboard and that way if someone really needs me and, and I'm not like obviously in my room or something they could write on my board and yeah so or if they want to write random stuff on my board, it may not even necessarily be for me, but um, yeah, so this one just has like black, green, blue and red. I really wanted a purple one. There was a pack that had purple, but it was way more expensive, so I just went for the four pack, so this should hopefully last me the year. Um, but yeah, but yeah. So that's the stuff that I got from Big W. And then just quickly a few items that I got from Officeworks. Um, I got just these like really cheap folders just for study notes and stuff um, for like when I do study. Um, and I just wanted to have something to organize my work soon. Um, or if I have any, you know, random loosely. Like, sheets of paper to put in just to keep it organized rather than having it half half of it floating around my room. But um yeah I got this one it's like a turquoisey I should know it's probably more darkish blue than I don't know it's not quite navy but it's some kind of blue colour but I liked it and it was these were really cheap they're like a dollar fifty so I got them, so I got one in this bluey colour. 
And I also just got a standard black issue one, so I thought two would be enough to at least for the first half, so the D. And then I got I was after loose leaf paper so I thought that would be easier. But then I just decided to get like um these 96 page binder books and I can just keep them in the folders and then do my notes on this. So I got two of them because they were like 97 cents so um, yeah um, I just got these like that nothing too fancy but um, and I'll probably get some lined paper, like just loose leaf paper, like down the track, but um, this should see me through um, for the most of the part, so at least for this tries classes, so there we go. And then, and lastly in the actual bag, I just got a random thing of sticky notes, so just plain yellow. Um, you know, if I need to put a reminder up or something, um, because I don't know if I'll have a wall calendar this year, because I think I got my f my one at, um, Black Saver Day, which is where they hand around free stuff and, like, things like that, um, and that's how I got mine, <laughs> but, um, I won't be there for Life Saver Day, so I don't know if I'll end up with one, but, um, yeah, if I need to remind myself of something, um, I can just use this or if I need to put like a study like like study notes up for all that and yeah so I just got this. So sticky notes. And the last thing that I got was I can lift it. It's really quite heavy. Um I got a new printer. <laughs> it's really heavy. Um basically um we were off, I was after ink because I ran out of ink towards the end of last year for my printer and we were looking around for prices and the inks were going for basically like $30 plus but this printer in Officeworks was $28.88 so basically $29 and it include, comes with ink so yeah it's it was like you were better off just buying the printer. So I don't know what I'm doing with my old printer. Um, my dad reckons that we should just chuck it because it's we only got it cheap in the first place. I think we paid about thirty dollars for it because I'm pretty sure this it's the same printer because it looks very similar to the one that I had. Um, like yeah, the one that I had last year. Um, even though this year I can't really see myself needing it a whole lot much because, um, as I said, it lasted me the whole year. Um, or I may not have said that, but um, it, yeah, it, I ran out basically as I was printing stuff for my final exam, so like my law exam, and um, I ran out. Of, that's when I ran out. And um, but this year I'm doing media stuff for like one of the groups at college so I will need to print something so I still need a printer because um, like assignments and stuff are submitted online so that's not an issue like I don't have to print I'm going to sit this down because it's kind of heavy um, so I don't have to print like my assignments and stuff like um, and that but yeah and I don't need to print my bills out anymore because I finally set myself up for direct debit <laughs> It only took me two years to do it, but I finally did it. It saves me having to go to the priest office to pay the bill. And, um, and I can just, you know, do things like that. Like, um, so they were really the only reasons I was using my printer. But, yeah, and, uh, but now, like, I'll need to, like, do, put up posters and stuff just to, you know, let people know about events and things, like, part of the cultural competition that um, we have at um, uni, that's like all the colleges competing, so, but, and I'm like media um, publicity, like, officer, and yeah, but, um, 
but I shouldn't need to use a whole lot because a lot of it will be like social media as well so but I still need like my printer and you know in case I have to print something else out um, if I need to keep something for records or things like that but yeah um, anyway I stopped rambling on with that but um, this yeah just a quick well, I hope it was quick um, stationery haul um, I've never done a stationery haul but I really do love stationery shopping and I've sort of amassed like all of this over like past couple of weeks because I needed as I said needed stuff for uni. The only things I don't have are my textbooks which I will get on my first day back which is the 23rd of Feb but um, I want to wait until I get my, I mean I could order them online but I'd rather wait till I actually went in to get them because um, at my college we have like a discount card that's part of one of their fundraisers and it used to tend to save quite a bit of money using it because um, and like and I don't need that many books this year but like I only have to buy books for two classes but one of my books my law book is like $282 <laughs> so it's kind of insane but um because I'm doing torts this year so and but Good thing is it covers both trimesters, like I use it all year round, I don't, it's not just for one, but um, so I don't have to fork out another $282 for like next trimester, but um, yeah and obviously I need, because um, I'm doing Indonesian this year, um, I decided to switch out my language, um, I just rather than attempt to retake it, because um, but yeah I just thought, um, and I thought Indonesian might be more beneficial to doing like a law degree and because um, I want to go into like international law and um, apparently Indonesian is one of like the easiest languages to learn so I'm hoping that's the case because um, and there's like no um, tense like the, the verbs don't change like um, conjugate, I think conjugate is the term for it because that was one of the things I had trouble with in French so, and when I was reading the info, it says there was none of those uh, like verbs and things that change, and I was like, oh, that would make it so much easier. But, um, but yeah, no, I just need to get like workbooks for that, obviously, and um, I'll probably invest in a dictionary of some kind to assist me. But, um, but I'll get that for, yeah first day because my first class is actually my law class, so. Um, but, but no, that's basically everything. I'll stop rambling. Um, I might do a separate video on my, like a vlog on uni and going back and stuff and talk about more in depth there. Um, cause, um, and then I can just do progress things like, um, like do one at the start of uh, the trimester and then do one like, you know, once I get my, res all my results back and, and that and then just see how I went overall and so I think I might do that as a new series for this channel, but um, but you know I th I so I was going to do this a bit later, but then I thought I like even then as I said like there's quite a few videos I want to do and I don't want to vlog it up like this channel up in like a week, and um, so and I wanted to actually show my printer as well and before I forgot like you know to bring it in, um but yeah so. I guess that's it. Um, yeah, seriously, stopping talking now. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry again about the background. I know it's terribly boring, but um, it looks way nicer than what my shelves look. So, because um, I'm trying to swap it out, like put my books in, because um, yeah, I want to like display my books, and I'm sort of just swapping it out and changing my shelves. I need more space but yeah I'm trying to make do with what I've got. <laughs> so um yeah um that's it. Thank you guys for watching and until my next video I will see you guys next time. Bye!